Scorpio, how are we? <laughs> how are we, guys? <laughs> um, I'm going to pull some cards for you guys, okay? I definitely do hope the messages resonate. Mm. And I definitely do hope the messages are useful. The sun is just out today. It's making me look washed out. <laughs> um, but yeah, Scorpio, I definitely do hope the messages resonate with you guys. And I definitely do hope the messages are useful. And with that being started, we're just going to jump right into it, okay? So, messages for Scorpio, please. Messages for my Scorpio. You got the Two of Pentacles coming out. You have the Emperor card coming out. You also have the Page of Swords. Good energy, good energy. You also have the Ace of Wands. Messages for Scorpio, please. You have the Eight of Swords. Messages for Scorpio. You also have the Temperance card. You have the Queen of Cups coming out. Your yeah, energy, Scorpio. And you also have the Nine of Swords. This can be revolving around a child's father, um, your father even. I definitely am more getting so this could be a thing where this could be like a baby's father, baby's mother type of thing with the queen of the king of pentacles at the bottom. Um, you got Aries energy out here, Sagittarius, Pisces, Scorpio, Cancer energy with this um, queen of cups. What's the two of pentacles? Because Scorpio is almost like, okay, with the Queen of Swords and the Ace of Swords coming out. Wow, with the Queen, with the King of Cups coming out as well. It does seem like somebody wants to be with someone. Um, somebody wants to actually, it seems like, tell someone this as well. Yeah, you got the two of wands. Whether you are a female or a male, you can have a you can have a kid. Like if you're a female Scorpio, you can have a kid. You could be a singles mother, which is why you came out in this emperor energy. Because I was a little thrown off by that. But yeah, you could whether you are a male or a female. Again, if you are more of a feminine energy, I feel like you came out as this emperor card as well. Especially if you are a single mother. And I honestly feel like you have someone mm, mm, waiting, almost like Scorpio. Someone could be waiting on you to make some sort of decision with the Queen of Wands. Like, you could have people, like, kind of fighting for, like, your attention as well. Yeah, with the Five of Pentacles. What's the Two of Pentacles? Let's get into it. You got the Seven of Pentacles coming out. Somebody wants another person to invest in them. Like, that's more so what it is. What's the Emperor card? Literally, with the Six of Wands. It's almost like someone's feeling like, am I not enough for another person? What's this page? You got the Ten of Pentacles. What's the page of swords? Yeah, you got the Knight of Pentacles. It's like somebody's expecting something from another person. They're almost like wondering what's taking this person so long. Almost like to commit to them as well. Literally with the Two of Cups at the bottom. What's the Ace of Wands? This could also be a thing where it's like somebody could want to collaborate with someone as well, Scorpio. And it's like somebody's wondering what's taking someone so long to like choose to work with them. Especially if you do work like online. I feel like somebody's going to go in a different direction as well. Like, I don't know what this is. Scorpio, whether this is you or someone like else, someone is going to like choose a different person or go and take a different route to do something and start something. What's this ace of wands? Yeah, she got the four of cups, the ten of cups, and the king of pentacles. Somebody could be choosing an earth sign, a Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. Somebody could even be rejecting an earth sign, a Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. Or like they're offered to like um, make amends to something as well. Somebody feels like another person really doesn't like them. Yeah, and it's a Capricorn, Taurus, or a Virgo. Someone from their past. Someone they grew up with as well. Somebody feels like another person secretly really doesn't like them. What's this Eight of Swords? 
Yeah, you're gonna have to page your wants. Somebody could have even heard about like what another person said about them. Yeah, with the Fool and the Nine of Pentacles. Yeah, uh, Scorpio, I don't know. It's almost like someone's really not really, someone, someone's not really, really, someone's not really concerned about like another person, like at all. <laughs> What's the temperance card? It's like somebody thought someone would be, yes, after leaving someone, like I don't, I'm not. It's like somebody could have walked away from you, Scorpio, or you could have walked away from someone else, and someone thought another person was like gonna miss them or like really go through without this person being like in their life, or they thought like things were like gonna be like stalled for someone. Like someone thought like someone wasn't gonna like be able to move forward. You got the Queen of Wands at the bottom of the deck, heavy Sagittarius, yeah, with the Six of Pentacles. It's like, oh, this person's not gonna be able to do it without me or make it without me or. Mm -hmm. Especially if this is like I don't know, like family drama, or it's like someone wanted someone to like pick sides, or it's like I don't mm -hmm. like somebody thought another person wasn't going to still yeah get like support. Like I don't know if this is like a business venture, or a job even. Like somebody was hoping like people were going to be on their side so much that like nobody would like support you. What's the Queen of Cups or like love you in a sense or I don't know, choose you even? Yeah, with the Hermit. This could be a Virgo as well, someone who comes off really loving with the Ace of Cups. Scorpio, you could be done with another Scorpio. This is a, this, mm. Taurus was like this too. You have, this is, yeah, with the star. This is a, a lot of spiritual people I feel like are watching as well. Um, of course, take it as it resonates. You don't necessarily have to be spiritual, but you. Mm -hmm. It's something about somebody being like really loved spiritually. That message kind of came up for Taurus as well. Like a very like strong spiritual person, like someone who's just really spiritual. I can't really stop seeing it literally with the lovers as I cut open the stars. Someone's like really gifted, really loved by like, I want to say the spiritual realm, spiritual people. Look, I'm dropping the cards. I can't really get over the feeling. Could be a Capricorn towards Virgo, heavy Virgo. Someone just has a lot of insight. What's the um, King of Cups, Queen of Swords with the Ace of Swords? Yes, you have this, the Justice and the Seven of Pentacles. Somebody's like choosing someone else. Like, I don't know what this is like a competition or, but it's like whoever thought like Scorpio, if, I don't know if you thought somebody was gonna like be with you or choose you literally with the hangman. Somebody who thought they were like gonna get picked for something is getting like left with the Five of Pentacles and they're getting left like, very barren, like close to like nothing. And it could be getting a Capricorn towards Virgo or Pisces. Could be getting like chosen as well. What's the justice in the seven of cups? Yeah, you got the six of cups with the three of pentacles. With the lovers at the bottom. Heavy Gemini energy. What's the three of pentacles with the six of cups? What's the three of pentacles with the six of cups? Yeah, the queen of pentacles coming out, the star and the strength. Yes, it could be. I don't know. Like, I don't know if someone thought they were like a showstopper or like someone Scorpio, whether this is you or someone else, someone thought they were better than a particular person. And it's almost like someone is starting to like outshine another person. And it's almost like Scorpio, whether this is you or someone, cause I'm, I'm gonna be completely honest. I feel like Scorpio, this could have been you doing this or just again, this could be someone doing this to you. Of course you gotta take whatever resonates, but it was almost like someone wanted to prevent another person from like shining or really like getting attention. I'm being completely honest, like someone, Especially when another person like gets around a set person, like so say Scorpio, this is your family member, your friend. Um, Cause I do feel like this is like a family member or a friend. Heavy family with my Ten of Pentacles and a Ten of Cups coming out. And I can see them. Normally that's like heavy family energy to me. Um, and like the Six of Cups, like all of those to me are like strong indication of family. Um, 
like if it's like a family function or like family gathering or even just like friends getting together it's like you had like one person really try to like outshine you or like outdress you or like especially this y'all work in similar fields it's like this person tried to like they wanted to like even the playing field like say you were an lp and this person strived to either be like an lpn or an rn like i don't say you are a cna this person wanted to be a nerd like an lpn like this person is either they want to be on the same level or higher than you and i feel like even still like with the, it just feels like no matter how much work someone like puts in to try to like outshine you outbeat you whatever the case may be you will forever be on top especially when it comes to like this person because this person they're doing things like very negatively like this person probably doesn't even like the job that they're in this person probably like lives beyond their means because they're trying to pit like catch up this person is trying to they're not living like authentically this individual like this person is going to always feel lack especially being when it's compared to you <clears throat> match two cards messages for Scorpio. literally you got the ten of swords and the ace of cups this is somebody who lives like beyond their means like beyond like this is somebody who like they're portraying themselves Like money is going to be the the death of someone with the seven of wands, like literally. Scorpio, I don't know. Even if this isn't you, I would definitely be very mindful about like how much you spend, what you're doing with your money, who you're spending it like on. Because I feel like somebody could even be like robbing someone like blind, like asking for more than like what somebody's like given as well. Like somebody's like ah. Could even be a Gemini with this Ten of Swords. But all right, Scorpio, that was y'all reading. I definitely do hope the messages resonate. And I definitely do hope the messages are useful for you guys. And until next time, bye. <laughs>